from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Matt Honig with the Penn State Campus Weather Service with your latest CNET forecast. We just had a very powerful snow squall move through State College. It really reduced visibilities rapidly. And here's a live look over the Arboretum. All this snow just fell within the past half an hour or so. You know, these grounds were pretty bare the past week with the warm temperatures and lack of snow. And now suddenly we have a fresh coating of snow here across much of Center County. Currently in State College, it's 25 degrees. Still a few snow flurries out there at this hour. But you notice that wind, too, out of the west at 10 miles per hour. It's making it feel like it's only 15 degrees outside, so you'll definitely want to have the coat handy, especially with those snow showers in the area. And I'll talk more about the wind in just a moment. But first, let's take a look at our radar and satellite. This is that very impressive line of snow showers and snow squalls that just moved through, and these are going to push off to our south and east over the next couple of hours. So I really wouldn't recommend any travel to the south and east of State College, as once these snow squalls do move in, they will reduce visibility very rapidly, and that will create serious travel impacts as well so you do want to be aware of that if you do have to be out there this evening. As I was mentioning, those winds are pretty persistent out there. These are sustained wind speeds, and across much of the state right now, we're seeing sustained winds anywhere between 15 and 25 miles per hour, and that's really reducing those wind chill values. The current wind chill here in State College, 15 degrees, and you notice just off to our north and west, near zero in Bradford, and single digits for much of northwestern PA. So that wind out there is really making it feel very cold out there this afternoon. A look at future weather shows those snow squalls that will be exiting our region. Could be left with a stray flurry or snow shower this evening. Then I think skies will clear out overnight. And by tomorrow morning, we're left with partly to mostly sunny skies and a much lower chance of snow showers. In fact, almost near zero. So tonight, as I was mentioning, there are those snow showers early. Low tonight, very cold out there. 17 degrees for a low here in State College. And that wind won't die down whatsoever. It'll be out of the west between 10 and 15 miles per hour. Now, Tomorrow, we'll see those sunny skies return. It'll be beautiful, except for that wind will still be out there. So that'll be ushering in still those cold temperatures. And I think highs tomorrow here in State College, at least only near freezing, a little bit warmer off to our south, a little bit colder off to our north. But again, at least we will have the sunshine and we shouldn't be seeing any risk of snow squalls out there. And like I said as well, that wind persisting out of the northwest around 10 miles per hour. So we will have that cold weather that will uh, stay in the forecast for the beginning of this weekend. But by Sunday, though, highs already into the lower 40s, the mix of clouds and sunshine. And then check this out. As we head to the beginning of next week, high temperatures return into the mid-50s, well above average for this time of year still. And we will see those chances of showers. However, I think by the time we get into Wednesday and Thursday, skies will clear. And we won't really notice a significant cool down after that, with temperatures still pretty mild in the upper 40s to lower 50s. Well, that's my latest forecast for now. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great weekend, and to all those Penn Stayers out there, have a great spring break.